So let's go over some key points to this exam. We begin at the common femoral in dual screen, open and closed. We can see here that the common femoral vein has been compressed. Moving to the saphenofemoral junction and femoral and profunda at the proximal thigh. If you notice, there is uh, calcification or some sort of shadowing here, which may inhibit visualization of the vein, so we'll make sure to pay attention to that as we move through the rest of the exam. Proximal, mid. Again, here is the uh, shadowing I was referring to. If you notice here, the femoral vein is off to the side of the artery, so we know that this would likely be the compressed vein here. However, in the case of the vein sitting directly posterior to the artery, it could be difficult to see the compressed image with this uh, calcification shadowing. So it's just something that we would pay attention to. And distal, and there's the popliteal compressed. If we look here, we see the calf veins. You can see here and here the perineals and posterior tibs. And we look at this image and notice that they are compressed. This isn't the prettiest image of a color augmentation for the calf veins. However, it does demonstrate, uh, particularly here, that you can see the augmentation. This is basically noise all through here. And the popliteal spectral Doppler tracing with an augmentation. And moving through the femoral vein and the common femoral vein. Uh, here's another area of uh, we, where we could actually improve by decreasing the color. It was caught at the moment of augmentation, likely, so there's a lot of noise here, a lot of color bleed. The scale is fairly low, so we could clean, clean up that image by increasing the scale a bit and turning down the overall color gain. But again, there's a spectral tracing that is a phasic, a spontaneous phasic, and with an augmentation. We move it over to the left side. We can see the artery, the artery, and then the veins compressed. Again, we see shadowing from calcification. All veins appear to compress fully. And here we have moved to the calf veins. These are a little more difficult to see in this image. However, we can assume that the sonographer saw the veins compress. And there are no obvious images or uh, views of a, an acute thrombus. And here we have the color augmentation. This is of the perineals, likely. I believe that you can see the posterior tip. At least this looks like the artery here. Um, and possibly vein above it, but it is difficult to see. Usually they sit one on top of the other, and color augmentation typically helps us identify calf veins, particularly when they're very small. Um, but we can look at this and see that there was a good color fill for the perineal veins at least. And we move back to the spectral Doppler of the popliteal with a good augmentation femoral vein and common femoral vein with an augmentation. What we should notice here in this view, this waveform is likely due to interference from other hospital equipment. So this isn't something we should generally worry about. This is just artifact. We can see the uh, augmentation here.